Well, things are back to normal tonight on the campus of Oakland University after a wild yeah. morning that had police sealing it off. They were searching for two people with guns, told students to stay indoors. As Victor Williams reports, it started with a shooting at a car dealership a county away. Well, campus police say the two men right here at Oakland University were seen being picked up by a silver SUV shortly after they tried to break into one of the buildings here. But as you guys can see right behind me, it looks like things are slowly but surely going back to normal. My roommate woke me up at 430 in the morning. He's like, there's some shooters on the campus. I was like, there's what? Students at Oakland University are no longer believed to be in any danger with the school issuing a notice that everything was all clear. I was very worried for all the friends I have living on campus and all my teachers that I know are here very early in the morning when this was all going down. So yeah, it was just a lot of fear in my heart. The entire situation is linked to multiple cars being stolen from a dealership in Grand Blake Township. One unidentified driver tried making a getaway in a 2022 Mustang and ended up crashing and dying on I-75 at Jocelyn. Police say two other people decided to abandon another one of the cars near Oakland University, and that's why students were asked to shelter in place for hours as the search for the suspects played out. The lockdown just kind of hit everybody at once. There's people who were locked in the weight room. There's people that were locked, you know, in the pool. I don't know where you were, but you had to stay where you were if it was indoors. Authorities claim the men were seen around the Meadowbrook Amphitheater, all campus activities were delayed until noon Monday, resulting in a lot of relief. I really hope that they get caught soon. I have a lot of friends and family around this area um, and around the area that they came from near Grand Blank. So it was, um, yeah, very, very frightening. And there's not much of a description for the two men that are on the loose. Both men are believed to be guys with slim build. Both are also wearing hoodies. Victor Williams. Local yeah. four. All right, Victor.